Hey guys, welcome to the Solid Cam University channel. In this video, I just want to cover on how to set up a default template. Um, so for this one, we will just be doing a quick iMachining one. So what I'll do is I'm just going to go to my iMachining. And let's just say that I want, instead of having a default number of 10 thou, um, I want to have it, or maybe it is defaulted to 5 thou, and I want to have a default of 10 thou. So what I can come in here is change this to 10 thou. And like I said, maybe I just want all my iMachines, no matter what, anytime I start a new iMachine operation, I always want 10 thou instead of the default of 5 thou on there. So just come in here, change what you need. Um, maybe you guys want to always have a, a floor with the contour um, with the 50% overlap. Once you have everything set where you want it, just go ahead and save that template. And I'm just going to save over this current one right here and hit OK. Now I can exit out of here. Now I can go to my global settings or my local settings. So if I go to my settings right here and go to templates and go to iMachining, and if I turn on iMachining, you'll see that my template will pop up with my 10 thou wall offset and my contour. So if I click OK on that, now when I go to start a new iMachining operation right here, go to the technology, you'll see that it's automatically already turned on for my 10 thou and it automatically turned on for my floor. Now you can also do this in your global settings also. So um, on your local settings, this will only occur per this part. Um, if you change it to your global settings, and I will show you that real quick here. Go to your solid cam global settings. And then what you want to do is come down to your templates, click on the iMachining tab, and I won't be able to do it right now just because I have a part open, and you can change it there. And this will do it for every single part that you create from here on out will automatically pull that template in for you. So just a quick little tip or trick uh, that you, to help you guys out. Um, if you guys aren't happy with the default settings in there, definitely those can be changed and uh, modified and added so you have your own template and with your own default settings in there. So any questions? please let us know. Thanks, guys. Have a great day, and subscribe to the channel for more tips and tricks inside SaltCam. Bye-bye.